So once we've completed our cab base drawing, we're then going to start working on our trailer base. We'll just remind ourselves what that part is. So it's this little section at the back here that supports our trailer and is the support for our wheels here. Again, it's a very simple rectangle, so it shouldn't take long to draw. It is a 55mm by 15mm by 75mm rectangle. So we'll draw that up in on shape. So go to create a new document, call this one trailer base. Once it opens up, we're just going to go to new sketch, select our top face, and we're going to select center point rectangle again, hover over the origin and start dragging out a basic rectangle. Once we've done that, we can then start dimensioning it. So click on the dimension icon, hover over that dimension, drag it out, change that one to 70 millimeters. We're then going to do exactly the same on the other side. This time we want it to be 55 millimeters. So now we've got our basic rectangle of shape that we're happy with. Click on the tick box and we're then going to simply extrude that. 15 millimeters and again I'm just going to select the shape I want to extrude and click the tick box. Again that's all we need to do for this section it's a fairly simple part. Last thing we need to do is just change the color of it so it matches the rest. So double click on the color palette, change it to our yellowy orange color and then we've got that part completed. Again if you want to you can hide all the planes so it's an easier diagram to draw. So there we go, our completed trailer base.